Well, he wears that mask all the time, so he doesn't get punched in the face too much. Uh, he's able to keep his face looking pretty smooth. <laughs> One month later, moments before the appeal hearing, how crazy it is. So much time has passed. I understand it takes a lot of time to gather the everything and, you know, for the court case. Oh, I understand that, but yeah, wow. I'm getting ready now. Sorry, son. Oversleep? <laughs> ah, I would never... Okay. Yeah. I'd right, see you at the courthouse. Oh, this is special. Is Yagami even going to get out here? It's such a kind of a big day. Okay, time for our hardest PO trial. Better take a cab to the courthouse. It's such a big day that it's like... What if they just kind of ended this game? Yagami walks out... Gets gunned down, and that's just the end. Bad guys win. <laughs> That'd be something. Held on violation of Shinjuku Station's anti nuisance ordinance, the defendant of this appeal is active duty officer Akihiro Ihara. He was previously convicted and sentenced to six months. However, the defense wholly rejects the sexual battery charge and asserts his innocence. The prosecution points to two pieces of evidence to prove the defendant guilty. One is the security camera footage from Ikebukuro to Shinjuku Station. The other is fiber traces from the victim's undergarments on the defendant's hand. The defense maintains this was not sufficient evidence to issue a guilty verdict. We have prepared counter arguments to each piece of the prosecution's evidence. How does the prosecution respond? We maintain the original sentence was perfectly adequate. That is all. Right. Well, that's, that's the best they can do. They don't want to admit to it, so they have then to be proven right. Let's examine the security footage from Ikebukuro. Even though he knows that he he, he, he also he knows trial. he knows this they messed up. I think. Ikebukuro Station on October seventh. Also, evidence and, and how freaking convinced all of us are, I, I imagine. Believed to be the defendant. This person remains in the area for over an hour, watching as countless trains make their stops. At 9.06 a.m., he locates the victim of this case, then he boards the train and pursues her. We've spent so much time this putting together the, station the details of this case right here. It's kind of cool. Board the train car. We already saw this during the first trial. Let's not be redundant. Of course not. The victim claimed the defendant moved in a suspicious manner once the train left Ikebukuro Station, ultimately placing his hand under her skirt. After they arrived at Shinjuku Station six minutes later, the victim gathered her courage and grabbed his hand. However, there's a possibility the offender seen here is not the defendant himself, but a different person entirely. A standing you know how long they it, they were kind of just grabbed the hand and just kind of held it as an alibi because the they didn't, she didn't scream she didn't say anything morning. very in suspicious words, but we already know this instance of sexual battery was a conspiratorial fabrication the original verdict was issued without taking this into consideration resulting in an inadequate trial the game has officially begun this is merely speculation the defense has no proof to support these claims. <laughs> Precisely the issue. <laughs> yes. There is indeed no definitive proof that confirms the existence of a stand-in. However, the notion itself cannot be disproved, even with all of the prosecution's evidence. Would you care to elaborate, please? The assailant fled the train and was caught shortly after on the Shinjuku station platform. Many nearby passengers filmed the scene, which then circulated throughout Japan. The impact may have been greater since the defendant was an active duty officer. Hey, that's that one fella. There's no mistake that the man apprehended at the platform was the defendant. Upon arrival, station police arrested him kind of a and jerk, immediately but, performed know, a trace it, element inspection. <laughs> I think we've uh, with that said, dealt with him in the last game. There's a very real possibility the offender who ran off the train was an entirely different person. And we have the evidence to prove that. 
Oh god, we have two offenders dressed like Ahara. What evidence shows they swapped places after one of them ran? The blind spot. I hate that we have to show this evidence in court. Look at this. What is this? Display it on the large monitor, please. Is that a diagram of Shinjuku Station? That's correct, Your Honor. First, the victim and the offender ran onto the platform as soon as the train doors opened. The train car they boarded is here on this map. We've marked the offender's route with an arrow. The lighter areas on the overhead view are within the security camera's line of sight. More people pass through Shinjuku than anywhere on Earth in a single day. It's packed with security cameras. However, this arrow with the dotted line reveals the existence of a small blind spot. That's where the defendant and stand-in swapped places. I see. So you claim this was their opportunity? Yes. As such, I'd like to question the defendant once more over this evidence. Defendant, when you were issued the verdict in your first trial, oh, it is. It you does said the do following that. to the funny. judge. Yeah, that's crazy. In a warehouse about three days ago, a body turned up in Yokohama. If that wasn't enough, you correctly identified the body as Hiro Mikashima, despite the fact the police had yet to do so. How did you manage to pull off such a feat? It came to me in a dream. Strange. Miko san was your son Toshiro-kun's classmate, was he not? That's right. Toshiro Ehara was found dead in his apartment four years ago. He took his own life. Afterward, the defendant sued the school over Toshiro-kun's suicide. Yes? Ehara-san, can you tell us why you sued the school? There were rumors my son had been bullied. Unfortunately, the court wasn't able to substantiate that claim. <laughs> He's These trying to get him discovered on the internet. I don't know. They were. Of the bullies mentioned, Miko Shibasan's name was among them. Were you aware of this? I was. Would you say you harbored murderous intent against Miko Shibasan? Objection. Yeah, the that was quite a jump. question is irrelevant. This case is to examine whether or not sexual battery took place. Yeah. Also, the Kanagawa police are actively investigating Hiro Mikoshiba's murder. The courtroom is no place for baseless speculation. How does the defense respond? The timing of the battery incident makes this case an alibi for Mikoshiba-san's murder. We believe there's a very relevant connection. Very well. The prosecution's objection is overruled. Please keep it brief. Just as soon as the defendant answers the question. Did you harbor murderous intent for Hiro Mikushima? Of course I did. In other words, Your Honor, it goes like this. On the day Toshiro-kun's bully, Mikushiba-san, was killed, the defendant set out to synchronize the murder with sexual battery. It became his alibi for the murder, and the prosecution and the court all but approved it. A six-month sentence for sexual battery and getting away with murder. That's all the motivation the defendant needed to fabricate this elaborate scheme. His stand-in groped his accomplice, and then they swapped places before getting caught. It's all entirely possible. Then the defense should present some evidence to prove it. Mm. Wrong. That's not how this works, is it? The prosecution bears the burden of proof in criminal cases. If we go through all the evidence and discover the possibility no groping took place, then it's on the prosecution to refute that. Fine. Have it your way. I mean, the defense's they're argument about the security camera's blind spot is flimsy at best. While the defendant was running, his female victim was chasing after him. Surely the victim would have seen if he had switched places with a stand-in. Yet the victim provided no such testimony. The victim, Yui Mamiya, was an accomplice in the scheme. Objection! 
This is an insult to the victim. Such <laughs> claims harm the integrity of all women. All women. What do I do? I can't back down now. How do I prove Mommy I wasn't a victim but part of a conspiracy? We have reason to doubt the victim's credibility. That's the proper way to we have good save the situation. We to doubt the victim's credibility. She was all part of his plan. In fact, that's all but sure. A 50-something man separated from his wife was driven by loneliness to harassment. That seems much more likely. The way you phrase that, is the prosecution admitting the defense's claims aren't wholly impossible? Beg pardon? That well, you said one way or the other. The verdict from the first trial was issued without 100% certainty. Now you're just nitpicking. Defense. If you claim to doubt the victim, then what is your reasoning? Yes, we do. In actuality, she wasn't the only conspirator who helped stage the groping. The bystander who captured the defendant. The witness who recorded the incident on his smartphone. Both men, in conjunction with the victim, were classmates from the same high school. Which means, strange as it sounds, that these seemingly unrelated individuals were, in fact, all acquaintances. It's clear that this was a carefully organized and planned event. Yeah, it's too big of a coincidence that they all went to the same Our school. Our investigation discovered they all graduated from Kurokawa Academy in Tokyo 13 That's, Yeah, years that ago. would just be too big of a coincidence. Yoko Sawa, the teacher who was killed in Ijin Cho, graduated and they would have recognized from the same other. class. Four years ago, she was the teacher of the defendant's son, Toshiroku. We believe this indicates a connection between the Kurokawa Academy graduates and this case. There's of the course, connection. That's as deep Sawa as Sensei ends up being that connection. We've simply presented the possibility that multiple conspirators were present when the defendant was apprehended. And as long as such a possibility exists, the defense asserts the defendant cannot be found guilty. Your Honor, may I speak? I gotta believe they're, them murdering Sawa what Sensei is, is what, what screwed them. I Maybe we could have got away with murder. everything. Per my conviction, I am just a pervert who victimized a woman on the train. Everything else is in the defense's imagination. Imagination, huh? Then I guess it's time. What time? Defendant. Why did you agree to this appeal then? Ooh, because the, the new evidence we have. That. I said the SD card. Stop them. How does the defense respond? It's just as the defendant says. However, we believe his recollection may be a bit fuzzy. To refresh his memory, I'd like him to take a look at some footage. Will you permit this, Your Honor? Now what? But please, don't display this on the large monitor. We shouldn't shock the public footage of a murder excuse me wasn't that denied as evidence as I said this is solely to refresh your memory it's up to the judge whether or not we show it please proceed that's just internet footage with no known origins or <laughs> yes he doesn't this know footage is from the SD yep. card in the camera used to record it this is a write once read many card, also known as a worm. The police use it to photograph evidence. Anything recorded on it is highly reliable data. After serving your time, <laughs> I mean, leaned in right there. This to the public. <laughs> but Kawana can't wait for that to happen. And that's why he left it in my care. <laughs> Don't kill me. Please. I'm sorry. Those who are good. I'll make it up to him. I'll atone for it. I swear I'll try to make it up to him somehow. I'll spend the rest of my life making up for it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it.
Defendant, in that footage, is the person in the white raincoat you? Mm. You could say it looks like me. The person you killed is Hiro Mikushiba. According to the autopsy report, he died sometime after 7.30 a.m. on October 7th. Therefore, it can only be that the person who passed through the ticket gate shortly after at 7.43 a.m. was not you, but your stand-in. As the defense, we cannot allow our client's conviction of sexual battery to stand in light of this footage. May we continue questioning the defendant? I say it? I'll allow it? the prosecution it? respond? Even if the footage has an irrefutable source, that alone does not prove guilt of murder. I'd just Why? like to state that in advance. Ow. So the prosecution is denying the murder? <laughs> Remind me who exactly is defending me here. <laughs> I know, right? Might as well hop sides. repeatedly mentions a stand-in, but where is this person currently? Who even mm. are they? The person if Kuana the walks through that door. Sunglasses, but he looked just like the defendant. We believe he used a mask made from a 3D I'm printer. If you look closely, the alleged defendant at Ikaruga yeah, no means Station of giving on the train is not uh, move his mouth at all. Destiny. <laughs> we learned this from sources who may have been the stand-in and the collaborators. Then we should call them to the stand to testify. Well, no one's need. dead. The defendant should know all of this already. I don't know anything about it. He said he doesn't know. So what now? The defendant admitted to sexual battery, not murder. The murder footage has excellent production value, but nothing else corroborates the defense's claims. Your Honor, I would like to request further witness testimony from the victim. Denied. Both the defendant and the victim certified the validity of the battery, leaving no room for discrepancies. No it way. Would be unprecedented for a victim to testify further in this situation. But she By lied. That, there's no precedent for using battery as an alibi for murder either. I will admit there is a possibility, but not enough to justify subjecting the victim to further distress in court. I must once again deny the request. But... Defense, I've made myself clear. Yeah, it would be a lot easier if we can get Mommy on there. the defendant's last statement, we have a few more questions. Understood. Please proceed. What's next? He's not gonna. Oh, I can't. He's gonna play dumb. So if I say you're familiar with Kuwa, Jin Kuwani, he's gonna say who? I don't know about asking. It's to be honest. Do you still have pride as a police officer? I feel like is the best thing. Maybe we can. I feel confident in that. You're an active duty police officer. Do you still hold that title with pride? It would be ridiculous to say I do now. But in my past, I took down criminals in the name of justice and tried to make a difference, even around the time of my son's suicide. And, as fate would have it, that same justice system decided no one was to blame for it. If I had to pick a moment my pride as an officer died, that would be it. Not that it matters. That has no bearing. It doesn't mean I killed Mikoshiba. I suppose not, huh? I still want him to talk about that, though. Well, who do you think killed him, then? As for Hiro Mikoshiba's murderer, who do you think it is? I work for the Tokyo Metropolitan Police. Anything in Kanagawa is out of my jurisdiction. All of his fingers were broken. A clear sign his killer held a grudge and intent. Then the investigation would start with anyone who harbored such a grudge. That's 
All I can really say about that. You believe Mikoshiba pushed your son to the point where he killed himself? Sounds like you have every reason to hold a grudge against him. Your Honor, this is going nowhere. The defense has been going off the rails all day. <laughs> Sustained. Defense, is there anything further? Let's ask him about Kuana. Harsan, you're familiar with Jin Kuana, aren't you? He's a handyman in Ijincha. Nope. Never heard of him. On October 7th, Kuana disguised himself as you and boarded a train in Ikebukuro bound for Shinjuku Station. He was the stand-in for the sexual battery mentioned earlier. Your Honor, no evidence has been submitted to verify that statement. The name Kuwana was not present on any documentation, nor was the prosecution notified. Kuwana is the very person who encouraged the defendant to murder Mikoshiba-san. Defense, as the prosecution has stated, no one by the name of Kuwana is known to the court. We've not even confirmed if he exists. Please <laughs> refrain from this line of questioning. But, Yikes. Your Honor, Kuwana is a key factor in the defendant's motive. Without him, Ahara-san never would have killed Mikoshiba, and we wouldn't be in this courtroom. Am I getting through to you? I... don't know of Kawan. No, you definitely do. Kawan is the one who fanned the flames of vengeance. You'd do well to remember that. the maybe it's this but that doesn't prove yeah I gotta believe it. it's the only piece of evidence that's not Take a uh, listen to this. Maybe Sawa what is it? Sensei's maybe it her voice was random return. internet post that made you decide to kill Mikoshiba-san, wasn't it? Even while battling the school in court, you still didn't this know for sure who pushed Toshiro-kun to his death. That's when Kuana came to you with this recording, right? Hmm? That's why do you <laughs> Shirokun came running to the roof. His face was pretty swollen. This is gonna set him off. And a few minutes later, a student named Mikoshiba came up looking for him. I'll never forget the fear I saw in Toshirokun's face. That's the voice of Yokosawa, the teacher Toshirokun confided in about being bullied four years ago. It was recorded in secret and played for the defendant by Kawana. He told me about everything. The teasing. The beatings, the theft, how nobody was on his side. And yet, I had to deny all this in front of an entire courtroom. Believe me, I never wanted to do that. They said there was no hope, that I was the only witness with no proof whatsoever. And they would just tarnish her record. After hearing this, the defendant came to believe Mikoshiba-san's unchecked aggression toward Toshiro was the driving force behind his son's tragic suicide. And ultimately, this became his motivation for murdering Mikoshiba-san and staging his elaborate cover-up. Isn't that right, Ihara-san? Is it coming back to you yet? Uh, afraid not. I see. Then, is that all? Can the defense please get back on track? This recording only came into my hands by means of Kawana. Except, thinking about it now, much like the murder footage, that would qualify as an unreliable source, wouldn't it? What? We live in an age where audio and video footage can be fabricated and easily reproduced. What are you getting at? Sawa Sensei, the one speaking in the recording, oh, was murdered whoa. only days ago. Yeah. And the one yeah. who recorded it, Kuana, disappeared without a trace. Meaning that as far as this recording is concerned, 
No one is left who can prove that it's authentic to the core. Okay. Except for you, Ahara. No damn oh everything in the recording is true. I get that, but why why are we showing or is our my hands? understanding incorrect? You would say you're completely unaware of the details about your son in this recording. Kawana had it. Didn't he play it for you? I never heard it. Regardless of the content, it has nothing to do with me. So you say. In that case, let's just assume then that Kawana and I are the only ones in possession of this audio recording. And considering that Kawana has all but vanished without a trace, that would actually make this the only copy and me the sole owner. No backup exists. What are you getting at? This has no value in this courtroom, then I'm afraid it's never going to have a value beyond today. And being that you claim it's unrelated to you or this case, then it wouldn't bother you if I were to delete it from my phone right He here needs now. it. He needs it after the fact. That's crazy. Oh my god, he needs this evidence after the fact to, to prove... Oh my god. Okay. That's how they got him. I shouldn't do it. Because he because needs it to rub in the face of the courts. Nikoshiba was a man who should never have escaped being judged. That's the proof of my son's pain. The proof that everyone ignored. That recording is all I have left of him. Oh, I really? Took the school to court because Toshiro deserved justice. But all they could say is that the cause of his suicide couldn't be determined. In the end, not a single person was held responsible. No proof, no justice. My son was hung up to dry. That confession yes. is the only bit of proof that something did That's happen. That's true. All of you. You're all so incompetent. You see yourselves as these paragons of law and justice. Yet the truth slips right through your fingers. And then... My alibi made you a mockery. I made it so real. You passed me off as just another pervert. You were gullible. Every single one of you. <laughs> Toshiro threw his life away and justice was blind to his pain. Mikoshiba walked free because of you. You condone murder and call yourselves the law. Yeah. That's why. That's why I did it. I took Mikoshiba's life with my own hands. And yeah, I'm rooting for the bad guys in this one. There it is. There it is. News just broke. All these guys are like, oh, we got to report this. Turns out he's actually a murderer. That pervert cop. You killed Hiro Mikoshiba in Ijinsho, then headed to Shinjuku Station where you and Kawana pulled off a switch. And there you were ultimately arrested as a Grover. Yeah. That's right. Defendant, you bear animosity for the whole system. We can't just take your words at face value. If you're responsible for Mikoshiba-san's murder, can you bring forward any evidence or just the murder footage? Can I talk about to murder weapon? The truth. I have something that I was holding on to for the impact that it would have. It's very real evidence that the law has failed us. What have you been hiding then? Will it prove you killed Mikoshiba? Yes. <laughs> then what is it? If you go to my wife's apartment, you'll find my son's altar there, in it. You'll find the weapon I used for the crime, the knife. I gotta believe the, the wife doesn't know that the weapon is in there. It still has Mikoshiba's blood on it. <sighs> Wait a minute, Genda Sensei. I prayed at that altar. Well, I guess you can lead a horse to water. <laughs> well then, we'll open an investigation. Let him write to the murder weapon, and he didn't Defense. find it. That Will is so funny. Further? They were there. They talked to the wife. That is so funny. No matter how justified, they were so close to doing it on their own. Take into our own hands. That said, in the case of Ahara-san. Our system failed him. We know the law strives to be just, but it failed to prove Toshiro Kun was bullied. That's not justice. Not when no one is held responsible. The law, as well as those who enforce it, 
are far from perfect. So to the court, I say let this case be a lesson. The law is failing to save people who need saving. This is a it's real thing, though. Should be adjourned. Court cases, them just... They're so sure covered, of the verdict, even the though trial. they may have gotten everything wrong. To do that via a special exception. The defense, law isn't perfect. Prosecution. Is that clear? No objections. The defense rests, Your Honor. <laughs> he did it. Jeez. Well, Kanagawa PD called from the Ahara residence. They've recovered the knife. I'm ashamed to admit that I was so blind to his scheme. Mm -hmm. Well then, that makes two of us. <sighs> Seems I underestimated you. Oh, is he giving it? And the worst part of all, I was arrogant. Legal authority and organizational connections should never be held above the pursuit of truth. I'm glad you were able to make me see that again. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, You've come a long way. Don't Innocent. treat him like a kid. Prosecutor Takano's been stubborn as hell from the day he passed the bar. Once he's made up his mind, nothing can stand in his way. Not even his own boss. And he only bows once in a blue moon, so I hope you remember this. <laughs> Typical Genda law. I'm never going to like you. Ah. Respect. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. <laughs> he hated the guy you throughout. He really and, pulled you know, it off. Great job. Turned out to be not such a bad fella. Just doing his job. Oh shit. Something else gonna happen? That always worries me. Yagami son. Oh no. The vice minister. Bondo. He's from public security. Uh-huh. Right. You handled that with such grace, Yakuza. We didn't mention her name. It's no wonder Kawana holds you in such high regard. What brings you here? Yagami sensei, would you mind if we talked alone? Why though? Something we can't hear? <laughs> the more you know, the more you risk. You'd be endangering your own lives. If you're willing to accept that, feel free to stay. Don't stay. Just let Yagami hear it. Room. At this point, we'd just be getting in Yagami-san's way. Thank you, sorry. Very, yeah, that's good. I, she's smart. She's smart. You guys don't gotta be stupid about this. We'll still figure out things. Have Yag hear it out and... Oof. Can't be having them... Putting them in danger. They're not soldiers. It was nearly a month ago that Kusumoto san received a letter from Kawana. Though we were unable to use it to trace him. And? What did it say? Soma told you, didn't he? Kawana hid Shinya Kawai's body, seeing as Kusumoto san's fingerprints and other traces were still on it. If that surfaces, the Ministry of Health will have yet another massive scandal on its hands. <laughs> as, as such, we want to recover and dispose of the body as quickly as possible. Perhaps we'll need to melt it down. The body was originally preserved to maintain control over Mitsuru's bullies. I never imagined it would be used against me someday. Fine, but why are you telling me this? Because of the letter he sent. Once Eihara-san's trial is over, he wanted to talk to you. Using my phone. Huh? Oh, shit. <gasps> is that Kawana? How would he know? Maybe because the news, breaking news. And once that hit the public, they knew the, knew the trial was over. Is Yagami there? Put me on speaker, please. Go ahead. So, it seems Ahara-san's trial was a big success. 
He took our failing legal system and turned it on its head. Couldn't have done it without you. I don't know what you're thinking, but public security has to be tracing this call. You have a plan? No, not this time. That's what? why I'm using my own phone. And that's just the way I want it. Can't run forever, you know. Why would you do that, Kwana? They catch you, you're a dead man. Why would he do that? That's exactly why I'm negotiating to prevent that. Kusumoto san. Yes. I'll be upfront with you. I never imagined the day would come that you would be the one to betray me. But <laughs> if I had to guess, we strings, Kuhn man. Must have woke up. If that's the case, then Kawaii's murder, your whole past. You're not the only one it stands to ruin. If all that comes into the light, Mitsuru Kun will be labeled the son of a murderer. Exactly. Yeah, we know. I can't let that. That's the one thing I need to prevent. I know. That's good. That's exactly what you should be doing. So please, don't stop now on my behalf. Enough is enough. You and your son have been through enough hell. I want to protect Mitsuru Kun too. Almost as much as his mother. Where is Kawai's body? Tell me. I can only assume this call is being traced, so even as we speak, I'm standing somewhere very close to it. Okay. Give us the location. I'm going to dispatch Soma. Don't dispatch Soma. Kawana, where are you? I'm an Injincho. If I take even one step out of this city, I'd be powerless. I've got nowhere else left to go. Kawana! Fuck. Where is he? After they find Kawai's body and Kawana is taken care of, I'm next on the list. The only other person that knows. can act at his own discretion. If he wants me gone, he'll be able to silence anyone who could know too much. Sawasensei was just the first victim. <sighs> you yourself have sealed this fate, you know. Will you tell him? Will you tell Mitsuru Kun about Sawasensei? Surely you know it wasn't my fault. Sawasan's death was a tragedy. I never it was imagined it would happen. What about Kuwana? Yeah, but she was killed because for can you. Can you imagine how his death is going to play out in a few hours? I can, but I'm not going to let him go down without a fight. Which means I'm going to Ichinjo. I can talk some sense into Bando. I won't allow him to kill indiscriminately. So please, like you have any don't control go out there to risk him. your life. This lady is not That's how it works. No promises. Tsukumo, Kawan is still out in Ichincho. Soma and RK are heading there too. We need to get to him fast. Wait, are you sure about that? You should be able to pick up some chatter. Pinpoint the location. I'm on my way. I'll talk Fucking to you soon. Chatter. Oh, bye. Here we go. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Arrived in a gene show safe and sound. What's happening? Is RK on the move? Oh, yes. A picture began circulating on the internet not long ago. It was likely Kawana-san who put it out there. I just sent it over to you. Hang on. Is this yep. Shinya Kawai? That's his body. Indeed it is. I data mined the image and found out it was taken just minutes ago. I also have the location. Oh? It's a warehouse company on Yokohama's coast. And Kawana's uncle came up as the proprietor. You mean Siren's owner? Oh, oh that's right. Address. Actually, Sugirashi is driving there with Kaito-san and Higashi-san right now. If you want to ride, take Isazaki Road and head to Surukame Highway. I can't count how many times you've come through for me, Sukumo. <laughs> Just trying to return the many favors, Yagami. Yeah, it's funny how uh, Sukumo's uh, like, role in these stories has has grown. Over 
here. Well, we didn't get to stock up on the items, but we got plenty of items. These RK assholes are like bananas. They only come in bunches. <laughs> we don't have time. We gotta head over there. Kwana's gonna survive. Guess they were expecting us. Sure are making a big show of it. What are those people doing? Oh, I don't like the looks of this. <laughs> yep, gonna be a brawl. Hundred percent. Kaijo-san, we're running out of time. Let's wrap this up quick. Yeah. Can't you see we're in a hurry? Quit stalling and come get some. We got company. There's more. I feel like we're going to have to face Soma one more time. And more. Okay, though, we're almost dead, though. <laughs> <laughs> you four, freeze! Oh no, cops are. Uh Some of them never show up when you need them. I know, They're right? Right there when it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Yep, we gotta go. Think this bunch is with public security? Possible. I'm not sure. Either way, we don't have time to deal with them. Hey! Relax, fellas. I can oh, shit. Guys. Oh, oh son. yes. Now it's on. Oh, and it's part of it. We can investigate wow. the connection to Ahara. Well, what the hell are you guys doing here? Kawana's in a tight spot, actually. Can I count on you? Will the cops help? What do you mean by a tight spot? Take a step back, please. 
These men are going to be under our jurisdiction. Oh, this they are. Wait. They are public security. We're dealing with a matter of life and death here. Be quiet. Hey, I told you I could vouch for these guys. Why don't we all just chill out and let them? Oh my God, he's going to kill him. Oh, he hit him. He just hit him. What the hell? Just goes to show. Let's fuck him up, man. out of this. Okay. Name and department. Our orders are coming from way higher up the chain than yours, sir. So again, stay out of this. There's nothing stopping me from arresting a detective. Or do you want to try me? <sighs> and do your orders include going around belting us with your batons? We're about uh, to seriously. have a problem here, aren't we? All oh, yeah. You put your hands up and face the car. I said move! I think it's time to fight. Oh, damn. It's Yagami-san. Oh, not with that. all the way out here. Matsu. Akane? Hey! Oh, nice. They're making a scene. They're making a scene. A very, very, a very modern way to. Oh, man. Nice. Sugiura, start the car. Okay. <laughs> He's creeped out. <laughs> They're not so bad. No, not at the end of all this. It's really cool how they play their part. Don't run them over, Jesus. Oh, the Lu Meng. Oh, hell yeah. That's what's up. He should. Sato should jump in. Or Tesso, sorry. Sato. Tesso should jump in. Jesus. That's pretty cool. Everyone shows up when we need them. Great. Guana's gonna be waiting for us. I'm on it. Going as fast as I can. The kids, that was like the most popular area of the town, so it makes sense that they were there. Ooh. Fucking thunderstorm. Tsukumo, we're just about at the place. You got a visual? Yeah, the view's great from up here, Yagamishi. From my position, it looks like RK is swarming the whole building. And Soma? I can't confirm his location, unfortunately. Kawanasan either. Okay, so give me a number here. How many RK we got? I'd say about a hundred. A hundred? It's a massive warehouse, so they need all the manpower they can get. They seem to have fanned out to search for Kawhi's body. The good news is there's no indication they found it yet. Tsukumo-kun, got any bright ideas for where I should park this thing? I'm afraid it won't matter too much. The enemy already knows you're on route. You will have a welcoming party no matter where you decide to enter from. <laughs> That works. Just means we get to show up and beat down the front door. I'm fine with that. I'm tired of all the stealth shit. Might as well just go right into the front freaking door, yep. Yeah. Do the gate. Heavy rain, hell yeah. And the lights of a freaking car. This is dope. What a scene. Are you guys ready? Hey, anyone now let's see what's up, man. Deja vu from kicking a bunch of asses in a downpour? I'm pretty pumped, actually. It's reminding me I'm alive, you know? Come on, man. Are you that bored back in Kamarocho? This is the final push, so everything's pretty epic. <laughs> Go! I wish you hadn't. I think we should. I think we should we use uh, one of those. What do we call them? Extracts. We already went through a bunch of people, so I think that's why they're like, you know what? A lot of these guys, not very tough. They got low health.
gotta equip another... Okay, we got some bentos. Uh, we still have 10 sushi sets, so sushi sets are gonna probably come into play in the final fight. <laughs> Probably wasted on that fellow, but that's okay. Ooh, he's got another weapon. Hey, who the fuck are you, kid? They're still coming. All the guys are almost down. Our guys are almost down. Oh, hell yeah. Boom. Nice. Little pick me up. He grabbed his own guy. Oh, I, for a second there, I thought he accidentally grabbed his own guy. Now he did it to take us up. Kaido and everyone is, is all full health again. Oh my god, they stabbed me. This motherfucker. <laughs> Hell yeah. What a whirlwind. That was sick, yeah. We gotta go again. We have the we have the power. Nice. Oh, that was a different one. Just <laughs> took all three of them. That's awesome. This dude's got a gun? Fuck, Nakazawa's got a gun. Nakazawa's got a gun. Nakazawa's got a gun. So run. <laughs> oh, shit. We're okay, we're alive. This is the last of them, though. Look, there's, there's no more coming.
this, dude. Dodges juice me again. What a pain in my ass. He's gonna kill us real quick. We gotta this that. Just got real scary. We're okay. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, fuck. That's so annoying. Guys, get him. It's making us drain that. That's not good. Get the fuck up, Yagami. Isn't that so silly? We were able to do so much damage to so many people so easily. And then now... Now look at us. You gotta do what you gotta do. I'm pretty sure that's all the RK has. <laughs> now it's just Soma. I'm sure there's some guys in the building, maybe. But I gotta believe that Soma and... Oh, they are inside? Come on. We have to fight our way through more? We gotta... Damn. All right. What are they so mad about? It's not like they're supposed to be here either. <laughs> yeah, they're just ransacking the place. This is all to find Kawhi's body. Well, if there's a bright side to any of this, it looks like they still haven't found it. Or Kuana. That's it. Break time, fellas! Let's kill these fuckers! Come on. <laughs> the guy ran up on me, he scared me. running low if this if we don't get to the boss soon we're gonna be running very low on um, items and health Got? 
Seen this number. Great, Soma. What do you get, Kuana? It's Kuana. I oh, okay. You're here. Then all the players have assembled. Wait, what does that mean? I mean, you're here too. Where are you? What is all this? Is, yeah, is this a trip? Put trick? simply, a trap for Soma, using Kawhi's body as bait. Nice. You must have known he'd show up too. Oh, of course. So everything from calling Reiko Kusumoto to this. To all Result to bring out Soma. Soma. Yeah, I'm gonna drag him kicking and screaming into the light. Oh, that's his new goal. Because he does it in the shadows, and his yeah. friends at public security just watch. Soma's a bully. Expose them. Usumoto-san can lead a happy life. You know she sold you out, right? Look, that doesn't matter. This is the only shot we have at Soma. Alone, I could probably kill him. But there's no way I can take him in alive. If you wanted help, you could have just asked. To deceive your enemies, start with your allies. And besides, if you didn't come, I had a plan B. Listen, I'm in the deepest part of the warehouse, far down as you can go. And so much closing in. And we'll just have to get there first. Oh, thank goodness we can take an elevator. What kind of plan B could he have when he's got a hundred guys surrounding him? I sure would have liked to see that. <laughs> Probably blow this whole place to kingdom come. Yeah. Might be some arcade down below, too. Probably right. He probably should have saved. They don't there's RK all over the place. Huh? How are the guys up there even doing? Come on, let's trash them. Oh god. Uh Hey, okay, do you want like burrito or something from Emma Queen? Wait, Emma Queen's different than Uncle Shoot. Mexican for Jake. Is this set? This. Oh, she's almost for set. All right, we do still have time to get through this. So, uh, my mom was coming over. She's gonna. Ah. Bring some food, it looks like. Ah. Oh, that's funny. Both these guys are scared now. I bet these, they made these guys like kind of easier to deal with, even though he just punched me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, they, they weren't so bad. Really, guys? Hopefully. I think so. She hasn't even gotten our order and it's about 20 minutes out. At least 20 minutes out, if not more. We just gotta, we gotta run it. We gotta find Soma. Won't open? Maybe they barred it from the other side. Hey, what's the plan? Let's see if we can find another way. Oh. Suspicious. There. Ram the door. Don't have the key. Damn. What's up there, though?
Yeah, might be on the way through. I saw something that we could grab up there. That's what made me think that. Suspicious. What the? Yeah, we can get up and move across. All right, let's do it then. Yes, I see where we begin. Different spots. Yes. Oh, you spot a way through? Yeah, let me see if it'll work. You guys keep watch in case anyone's tailing us. Gotcha. You can leave that to us. Be quick, but keep it cool, Todd. I've spent the last hour playing <laughs> you brought it up the other you brought it up yesterday uh what one have you been playing in a way that they what the fuck in a way they want me to run that Maybe they do. Oh, that's what they wanted me to do. I have to do something about... I don't know what we did about that, but we did something right, about it. You made it. Backpack now hero. Let's high tail it to hmm. What are you doing it? That door looks like it leads ahead. It's locked. Let me see if I can pick it. Better be able to. Son? There's a trap. Hey, hold it right there. Ah, damn. How many of these guys are there? Tak, Sugiura, Higashi, and I'll keep them busy. You guys go on ahead. Oh, here we go. Counting on both this you guys. kind of like turn-based combat meets Tetris. That's kind of cool. What do you pull out of your backpack? Well, what is what? What does the hero have in his backpack? Another pile of shit. Well, Yagami-san, I guess we can handle this. No RK around here. Yagami-san, find a way to follow me from where you're at. Oh, I see. We got to swing across. All right, there we go. Uh. 
this way now? Are you kidding me? Ah, here we go. <laughs> Still more of them. Oh, fuck. Jesus. Just get the fucker. You know, I'm not gonna finish in time. I like the kicks, but we haven't been able to pull that move off very well. Yagami-san! I'm a little tied up over here myself. Go on ahead, yeah? Hey. You alright? I think so. In better shape than Kuana-san, at least. Now hurry up, Yagami-san! Damn it. You better be right behind me. You know I will! on game can we stop with this bullshit come on as if they didn't make the last part fucking long enough from the last time i've been able to save now it's just pissing me off cool so there's a fucking thousand people in this warehouse for one and then they're gonna want me to somehow get through this whole warehouse and we can't go the way that everyone else went because what they they decided to spend all the time instead searching to build obstacles and, and make it so it's impossible for us to follow. No, it's fucking bullshit. Just hurry up and get the hell through this. Cool. So what is that? Not how it's supposed to. Be?
Why wouldn't he just jump off? If I have to fight those guys anyway, I swear to God. Why the fuck are we spending our time climbing above them? If it's just going to be like, oh, you're going to drop and you have to face them anyways. I'm just supposed to drop down, then just drop down. I don't stop. Gotta think. No, no, they think that this is this is good. I said, hey, let's let's take forever. On the keys. <laughs> this that was no good before. You couldn't find the keys, but hey, I guess if everyone's got the keys. Can't. It's the end of the game. It would be pointless to stop and then just bring up the stream tomorrow for 30 minutes. Wouldn't make any sense. We're like literally at the end of the game. annoying when they say oh you know here here's a all the chapters throughout the game are like maybe two to three hours an hour to two and a half two hours or so and then they're like this last chapter let's make it six hours As if a, the side of a fucking truck isn't a wall that I could fucking jump off of. Get the hell out of here with that. Right, I can do it off a forklift, but I can't do it off a fucking truck. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Was the end of our that's a problem a big problem That does so much damage. Thank goodness. And stay down. Please tell me Soma is just around the corner. Let's 
still can't save. Another elevator. Might take us straight down to the bottom. Kuwana-san and Soma are probably there too. I better take us straight down to the bottom. Gotta get ready first. Yeah. What do you mean? It's not like we can go shopping. We need to smoke. I'm very frustrated. we get out of here. This air is unbearable. Sir, do you think Kuwana's is still around? We already tore this place up. Couldn't he have been? <coughs> well, he did. Yeah, we're tricking him. With Kauai's I don't even think the body's no here. No cars have gotten in or out of here since we showed up. Just find the body. We can deal with Kuwana later. Soma-san! Go check it out. Kauai's body. Sir, uh, I uh, think we found it. Ooh. Do you see? You can do anything if you put your mind to it. Yeah, looks like we found Yo. it. How we doing? Sir, <coughs> I'm the one who found him. We were just about to pull him out. <laughs> I'm the one who found him. That's him, all right. <clears throat> He's so fucking nasty. Good. Get this thing out of here. I've got a buyer ready to pay quite a premium. Good job, everybody. Oh, that was the trick. Eh, hey, got the one guy. That was Kuana, I'm sure. It's Kuana. <laughs> you thought you could hide? Show yourself. Don't you want to try to negotiate? You call this a negotiation? You don't bring a gun to a ceasefire. Jesus. You've led us on a hell of a wild chase, Soma. <laughs> Shot his own guy. Oh, man, that's funny. Oh, that's funny. Oh, no. One appears. The weakest dies first. Nope. That fucking I know, like, I don't think they know who they're messing with. <laughs> yeah, no one, no one in our crew is a wimp. There's Kuana. You made it out alive. The man finally appears. So, is all this playing out exactly as you planned? More so. If we can catch this murderer here and put him in chains, then I'd say we're off to a good start. <laughs> That's hypocritical, isn't it? You say I'm a killer? What's your body count up to? I'm just a former Japanese Probably not teacher. as high as, as so Sounds to me like you've got it all wrong. Well, doesn't that figure? The only teacher I ever hated was in my high school Japanese class. Soma. I don't know if I've ever met a more twisted piece of shit. <laughs> Undercover agent or whatever. You've crossed the line without giving a damn. Undercover agent? My men don't need to hear this shit. Yeah. So oh, my men don't need to hear this shit exactly. He wasn't. That's coming. some details he doesn't want anyone to I'm know. Afraid that's what you say when you that's have funny. The upper hand. He's because uh, Soma's working both sides. He he was placed undercover to in, in, infiltrate the. Yakuza, nice. but they pulled him out Turn as soon as the Yakuza were, were about to, time to give be taken hell. out okay. from the families. Oh, and then after yeah. that, they had him start, public security uh, had him start up uh, this other gang to kind of keep keep tabs on all of the ex-Yakuza and, and in fact control them, with. which is, and they created the RK. Pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh, God. I think we should use our some extracts and stuff right now. Is 
Is that what I ended up just doing? My bad. I need to eat. What does this do? An experience uh, made with all natural. I don't know what that means. How is that? How is a hug bomb useful at all? That didn't do shit. Uh, we don't have any. Oh, we should have got more of those bonito flake cat foods. That could have made us very deadly there. Yeah, I'm actually kind of curious of this. Do you guys want to see what this lightning blade is? A mysterious extract that grants you the sword of light from the heavens with circle, circle, circle for a combo. Hold to charge. Fuck it. They want to bring a weapon? Let's bring God. Great. My fucking ears just went out. I'll put a little bit in the. Uh, what can we really even do with Crane? Holy shit. Is that really is that? We have a lot of experience that we could use. Uh, I should probably put it into. I guess let's let's do it. <laughs> it's funny to have that happen so much. That's interesting. I'm gonna. I forgot to use it. I forgot I made it and we didn't even use it. Ah, <laughs> it is. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, perfect time to use this. Perfect time to use this. No. Yep. Well, it was perfect time. Ah, it's still perfect time to use it. Haha. <laughs> Nice, Goku on a moment. Go talk. Get, get away. <laughs> That's a safe spot. Is that a safe spot they just gave us right there? It is. Ah! I'm gonna grab it just in case we run out of... Just We're still gonna do this. But it's just in case I uh, die. There's no way I'm repeating all that other shit. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's fucking do this. <gasps> yes! <clears throat> Very cool. Let's do this. Thank you. 
Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Oh yeah, we have that. I'm starting to hate this move. I do it so much. Eat the pizza buns. Eat the pizza buns. No, I didn't mean to do it again. See, I hate it. I hate it so much. But we're doing, we're doing it. I'm gonna make another extract afterwards as well. Pretty sure we can make at least another, at least one more extract. Gives a little boost. We haven't been using them throughout, so. I did a lot of damage. I'm right here. Let's see, what kind of extract should we make? Deceptive mist tactic. That's a, to produce a hallucinogenic haze. That sounds cool. Let's do it. Ah, he stabbed me still. What do we got? A lot of. They're pretty filling. I like that answer. It's up your sleeve. Oh my god, he stabbed me again. What a piece of junk. I missed it. I missed it. Up. And those were not filling at all. Holy crap, <clears throat> we're okay. That hit very hard, but we're okay. Thank you for the hug bomb, Omega. so cold do we get him it's gonna be quick time he's so cold pay attention <laughs> oh no chef have <laughs> the fucking swedish chef that's adorable have a great night mounty uh, have a good have a good night i'll catch you next time we got the end we did it guys that was it I guess I did have time. My mom didn't even make it here. She, uh, yeah, she should be here too. <laughs> with evil being necessary for order. You'll run the cell for the rest of your miserable life. He's gonna kill him, isn't he? Something's telling me he's not gonna. Skuan is the last face he sees. Oh, I do like that. Okay, cool. No, it was trusted. Every clean this shit up. That's good. We did it. 
Look at the guy. She did, you've taken a rest. Oh my god. Yo. You might want to stay away from that. Pull it out any further, and it'll set off the bomb I planted. No fucking what? way. That it was could Plan B. Very well end up going off anyway. But that'll be up to me. Bro, not cool. Not cool, Kuana. Oh, what the fuck? I can't keep track of how many times this guy has changed sides. Are you kidding me? Did Kuana screw us again? Exists. Kusumoto's son will never be free. What the fuck? So I'll make sure it's never found again. You guys might want to consider stepping out. Kawana, you can't do it. He could have done this. But I can. Well, he had to take out Soma first. This was always going to be the backup plan anyway. If you guys hadn't made it down here, I would have blown up both the body and Soma all in one shot. Yeah. But still, if Soma dies, I'll never get to the one pulling the strings. And Kusumoto-san will never be free of these goddamn shackles. Kusumoto-san needs to turn herself in. If she keeps trying to hide from all this, she'll be haunted by her past wherever she goes. You'd rather she carry those sins for the rest of her life than all by herself. Because after today, you won't be there to help anymore. You have to leave. You'll disappear. From here on out, you'll need to live deep in the shadows. If she turns herself in, she'd never be able to see Mitsuru again. Her son is finally awake, after 13 years in a coma. Does tearing them apart sound like justice to you? I want nothing more than for everyone involved to get a happy ending. But still, Not possible. if I turn my back on it now, Sawa's sensei's sacrifice becomes a footnote. That won't work. She can't say her piece without a voice. So if I don't raise mine for her, what justice prevails? Fine. I'll just push the button. Everyone in here can be blown to hell. Why would you do that? Are we gonna have to face Kuana? You really gonna do that? If you guys don't back off, then I will. Do you know how many people I've killed through the years? No. But if you were really that kind of scum, we wouldn't have come down here. You wouldn't be the kind of person worth saving. Damn straight. Come on, we can win us heart. Yeah, this come on. This one is my fight, guys. The way I see this, Tuck, you and Kuana both have your reasons. Something to consider. But between the both of you, is there really a right answer? Shit. There we go. <clears throat> the actual final fight. I need to give myself some sort of serum. There's no way we're going to get through this. much here try this one Jesus, he's fucking us up bad, too.
Nah. Got him on that one too, though. No. Yikes, this isn't good. Let's put that out of our... Oh, shit. I'm getting very nervous now. Yes, 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 this is good. Oh shit, I fucked up. That's not good. Oh, that's definitely not good. Did I mess up? Oh, yo, I didn't realize this. I forgot about this. That was great. Here we go again. Come on, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. That would hurt. Down? I think we did it. My God. <laughs> yeah, getting freaking roundhouse kick off uh, off that would have really hurt.
Oh, that's sad. Lost. You can't give up. I don't want Kusumoto san. She shouldn't have to keep suffering. The truth, we put too much value on it. All it does is crush us. That's not true. It's because the truth was being hidden. That's what led to Sawa Sensei's death, isn't it? Set Kusamoto free. It's time for all this to end. I mean, you've got to already know. When justice breaks, someone's always going to find a way to redefine it to suit themselves. And from that point of view, everything you do feels justified. That's why. That's why you're able to look past the sacrifice and the damage you cause. No. I didn't want this. I get that. But who decides what's wrong? Who gets to decide what's right? That's not us. Come on. Sawa Sensei died because you made the choice for her, and you took her truth. Who does that really serve? Tell me who. Why would you want that? The truth is all we have. When the law can't be fair, the truth becomes our last ray of hope. So please, Sawa Sensei's truth. Don't take that from her. Cops are here. Someone's here. Oh my god. Kusumoto. Kusumoto san. Kitakata sensei. I couldn't. I couldn't protect you. I couldn't even protect your secret. Please lift up your eyes. I saw that picture you posted of Kawhi's dead face. I took a hard look. This was the man I killed. I saw the pain in his propulsive face. I saw the consequences of my actions. Sawasa never should have been dragged into this. I saw how I betrayed and abandoned you, too. Kusumoto-san. I've been frightened ever since. I was scared Mitsuru would find out the truth. I was worried he would discover his mother was a monster. And for you as well, Sensei. You carried it for me. You clung to such a dark secret. I made you do this for so long. <laughs> I never should have gone through with it. And I won't let you bear the burden of my mistake anymore. <laughs> That's why I've decided. I'm going to turn myself in. Come on, guys. <laughs> Just kill kill Yagami real quick and get away with all of your secrets and stuff. I feel bad for them. I don't even like it. <laughs> I wish Yagami would just drop the freaking drop all of this and just let them take out the bad guys. I know that in taking out the other bad guys, her name will definitely come up, and so she's kind of screwed anyways. But she's like, I don't know. I, have I wish they could have happy you, Mitsuru. Your mother won't be coming home for a while. Oh my god. Mm -mm. It's not work. I feel I should warn you. I'm going to be placing a burden on your shoulders. I'm so sorry. Mitsu? Please don't worry, Mom. If anything, I should be the one worrying about you. Huh? 
I could tell something was bothering you. You've been hiding a problem for a while, haven't you? I'm sure it's been hard. Especially considering what a burden I've been. No. That's not it at all. Don't worry, Mom. I more or less already know. In fact, let me tell you. I was doing physical therapy earlier, and I managed to take a few steps. For the first time in 13 years. <sighs> That's... wonderful. It didn't feel like much, really. But still, you know what the doctor said? That if I keep at it, I'll be able to stand on my own two feet. And then I'll be able to walk again pretty soon. <laughs> When that time comes, I'll be there for you. It'll finally be my turn to support you. So please don't worry about me, Mom. Don't let me hold you back. Go do whatever it is you have to do. I'll be waiting. I'm sorry, Mitsuru. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Enter. I don't recall having an appointment with any prosecutors today. Are you familiar with Kazuki Soma of RK? <laughs> oh, man. Public security's inside man. He infiltrated the Kamurocho underworld on assignment. As you're aware, he got caught up in some illicit activity. You knew this. Yet somehow his actions stayed off the record. Whatever you're talking about, I have no idea, son. It, is it really? Just Are they about? Be some cops are about coming. By Kanagawa police. The investigation is ongoing. He's the prime suspect in the murder of Yokosawa in her Yokohama home. It's our suspicion that he was acting on the orders he received from you, and that would make you complicit in her death. You wanted to manipulate Reiko Kusumoto, and so you stooped to blackmail. Let me guess why you're here. You want to put all of this out in the open? If it means exposing the truth, certainly. <laughs> you want to burn down Japan? This is bigger than me. <laughs> it could go all the way up the chain. People of power nationwide would be dragged He's going to be thrown out of the bus. And some of those people might even be the superiors cutting your paychecks. Yep. But the bureaucracy isn't the monolith you think it is. The more political power you wield, the more enemies you have waiting in the shadows for the opportune moment to strike. We've met with them, and we have their full cooperation on this. <laughs> As a result, Soma-san's security footage has been recovered. It had mysteriously gone missing when the investigation was opened. <laughs> Upon further review, Kazuki Soma is clearly visible in it. Who would have the authority to order that evidence to be locked Yo, away? Oh, oh no. That would be you, Bando-san. Fucking busted. Oh, that's great. So it actually it did work. You know, I was afraid that, you know, for my part, it, I did the, the thing. Top I guys still get away. I'm trying to maintain order. It's not hyperbole that I've saved us. My actions. So if you intend to drag me through the mud, I'll see you in court. So we will. That said. We got this far because those detectives persevered. So I wouldn't expect the prosecution to drop the ball now. <laughs> yep, sharing, sharing the confidence. Hmm. We only got this far because those detectives persevered. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wouldn't have expected that from Takano, much less about Yagami. Yes, but Mafuyu said she overheard it herself. He did really say it. <laughs> he did really say it. In the meantime, <laughs> Ihara-san has been charged for Mikoshiba's murder, and Reiko Kusamoto for Shinya Kawai's death, too. Both of them are fully cooperating with the investigation. Well, I suppose that ties everything up with a bow, except for Kawana. What do you mean? Yes. Kawan is still missing. Wait, he's what? the last of the loose ends. They let him. He did go. He so did run. He is. And he's you gonna he's stay gone. 
Would he risk his life to keep hunting down and killing bullies? I kind of hope he does. Well, I have my doubts about that. Why do you say that? Yagami-san believes he can turn over a new leaf. Ah, uh, some things never really change, do they? This place is still filthy. <laughs> Squeaky and clean isn't gonna work for everyone. That's all a matter of taste. I'd say this place just has flavor. You brought <laughs> some snacks? Yeah. We stopped at the convenience store around the corner on the way here. Come on, Tak. You don't want to be you treating the boys. Well, we Bring definitely some ran out. To show <laughs> how generous you are. Oh, should I know? Well, I'm already way ahead of you. We went through Yo. all, all of our freaking food and everything. Someone order some sushi. Nice. Only the best for you guys, courtesy of Yagami Detective Agency. So, <laughs> uh, <laughs> shit, man, you are a true gentleman. Hey, what the fuck? There's avocado. <laughs> oh, shit. Where the hell did you get this from? Aniki, if you don't like it, you don't have to eat it. <laughs> Thanks. That's funny. That just leaves more for me. Fine. And I can treat you to the insanity. Hey, say leave it to Mago. As long as I got my egg, I'm good. <laughs> I know, right? That's the yeah, I know, seriously. With you. The cops can have him. But then I'm out. I gotta disappear for a while. I'll fade back into the shadows. Like hell, man. Hey, we if he's arrested, public security would have his head. They'd charge him with the one murder he didn't commit. Sawa Sensei wouldn't get the justice she deserves. And worse, Ooh, they'd find a way to silence him. Besides, you don't have any proof that I'm even guilty. Anything sure. they could charge me for would never stick. Just what you he had everyone else do everything. You said yourself that you spent the last several years to He's just been the puppet master the, the whole time. Yeah, but he didn't actually do the, do the work. I never eh. left a single shred of evidence behind. So good luck. The cops and the prosecution would have nothing to go on. In a legal sense, all you guys can really do is stand there and watch me walk out of here. <laughs> I'm happy oh, to. Never been very good about I like being Kuana. Flexible. The whole system is hollow. It can't judge who needs to be judged. It can't save who needs to be saved. I'll expose that. Every action I take serves that goal. As long as kids like Mitsuru continue to suffer out there, I'll do it for them. Even if it means I have to keep my hands dirty, I don't care. Goodbye. You're right about one thing. The law is hollow. As it stands now, the system does fail people. All the same, the law evolves. We have to make it better. But it takes time, and the work is never done. That's why. That's why, as long as the law lets people fall through the cracks, I'm gonna be there. Except, I won't do it anything like you. find out come on uh, don't you have anything to say huh you owe us an answer don't things you? never change I'm things sorry. never change and there it is i knew you were lying all along you are oh lying here we go shit huh what do you Step, have to say, say something lady you think your apologies say something lady it? you're in deep shit girl and that's not how this fucking works so look over here real quick say i'm a bitch and a liar for the camera <laughs> Do it, or it's gonna get a lot worse. Wow, isn't this gross? What are they doing to that poor girl? It's it's the it's the old bullies. That's so freaking weak. 
Mm -hmm. Pretty fucked up to gang up on her like that. Yeah, they're doing the same gimmick that that, uh, that was done on them at the beginning. Very good callback. Move it. You don't have to. You've got no reason to go with these guys. There, there she is. What the hell? Mind your own business, assholes. Do you really think we're the ones being assholes? Yeah, that's pretty rude. You guys gotta learn when it's time to give it a rest. Who the hell are you guys? Hey, you three, you need to leave. And stay away from that girl. Terrible kids. I'm so glad uh -huh. someone finally stood up for that it's young lady. I know. Aren't those serial high students? Hey, let's just go. Come on. Are you okay? I'm sorry. That's what I apologize for. Be. I'm sorry. Really. I just wish I had seen what was happening earlier. You'll be fine. Yagami's good deeds. They had a lasting effect. So to our breaking news, after an anonymous report, the Tokyo Metropolitan Police have announced the discovery of five murder victims. Five? Oh my God! So we have across the country, all five victims have evidently been deceased for several years. So they According did According to the anonymous tip, the common thread between these victims he did is that they were all at one time accused of malicious school bullying. The police are working quickly to identify them, and an investigation task force is being launched immediately. This task force's first challenge will be to secure the cooperation of law enforcement across all of the prefectures involved. Hmm. I mean, they made their point. They got the message out there. And, uh, you know, the bad people paid. One way or another. Some people made lots of sacrifices to ensure that happened. So, I don't know, kind of a cool guy, even though he was kind of a bad guy throughout this. That was pretty great. Is this, uh... Can't skip it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's it's over, it's over. Alright guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I know this was a long one today because we finished up this one. Uh, great game, great story. Sad. Sad stuff, but very happy ending. That's good. So uh, I'll be back tomorrow. We'll probably play some Gran Turismo and just fuck around, hang out, um, and uh, race cars. So uh, thanks for hanging out anyway after lurking. Have a great night, and hopefully I catch you guys tomorrow. See ya.